Hi guys, I got a new Ascension message. Before we get into this Ascension message, uh, for those that are new to my channel, on this channel, we extract Ascension messages from Ascension codes. And Ascension codes are short messages that people receive from their dreams, meditation, sometimes even vision or otherwise. They send these codes to me and I look up the phrases with the same gematria value and translate it to a message. If you want your dream code translated, send it to my email address, briancalling at gmail.com. Remember to add the backstory and let us know how you got the code. Don't be afraid to be as detailed as possible. Now that we got that out of the way, I wanna welcome my new subscribers. Thank you guys for subscribing. Welcome to the family. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please remember to subscribe and hit the bell so you can be kept up to date to my messages in the future. Without further ado, let's just get into the message. The Ascension code is from Aluna Ash Clairvoyant 5D. And I have to put in a little disclaimer. I didn't get it from her personally, but I sent her an email. I sent her an email. I uh, made a video from a code from Aluna before, and uh, I got a message after I sent, uh, after I made the video. The, I was watching a video um, from Aluna Ash, uh, and the title was "New Earth Is Here." Yeah, and the video yeah, it was it really uh, resonated with me. That's why I thought I'd just put it in uh, in the Gematrix engine and uh, see what I get. And of course, I got a code out of it, and I'm just gonna share it with you guys. Let's just, let's just uh, get into it. Children born of the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is on earth. There's one body and one spirit. Voodoo magic spell broken. The door out of the matrix. Linguistic prison matrix. So I'm just gonna stop there because uh, I heard it uh, before. <clears throat> the linguistic prison matrix it's a theory that our language, our language is is what is limiting, what is limiting our ability to think out of the box, yeah, and also limiting our ability to see ourselves as divine. And language has a great part, uh, plays a great part in this. And um, I made a, I have uploaded a couple of videos on my channel about maritime law. And that falls, uh, falls kind of uh, in, uh, in this linguistic prison matrix theme. Yeah, Earth is a slave planet, the Tower of Babel. So coming back to the linguistic prison matrix, the Tower of Babel. When, when the Tower of Babel got destroyed, humanity's uh, language got mixed up. And we couldn't understand each other anymore. So maybe it has a deeper meaning. Maybe it has a deeper meaning in the Tower of Babel. Is something that happened uh, in our brains, you know. So uh, they changed they changed the the language to put us in a linguistic prison matrix, the Tower of Babel. This universe, thirteenth cube, divine alignment, the balance of power, half halfway the great between. So we're in the great between right now because the balance of power is about to shift, and because it, because time is not linear. Time is not linear the way we uh, perceive it. Um, the effect is the great awakening. So the effect of the changing of the balance of power is the great awakening. And because time is not linear, because time is not linear, we are already noticing those effects. Yeah, Half, we're halfway in, we're in the great between. True God about to kick some ass. Zeus thunder dagger. And then I got these values. I always get tarot card values when I do a Luna Ash code. King of Swords, Five of Pentacles. So I don't know what that combination of cards means in this setup, but I, I have a, 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 a <clears throat> but I have a lot of subscribers that do know. So if you do know, just let us know in the comments what uh, the King of Swords and the Five of Pentacles in this combination means uh, in regards to this message. Yeah, let's just continue. Speak of the devil. I'm not your friend, Satan. Free, free the souls from Saturn. There are no soulless organisms. Just gonna, I'm just going to stop there because a lot of people were thinking that there are people walking around that don't have a soul. But it turns out that all, all organisms are, have souls. There's, there are no soulless organisms. The fallen souls are tropospheric. And it's also, I'm just going to go back because it's also... Uh, Telling Satan, uh, Saturn, to free the souls from Saturn. I'm not your friend, Satan. Free the souls from Saturn. 
there, and it goes on to explain that there are no soulless organisms. The fallen souls are tropospheric. Uh, tropospheric means earthbound. The Jesuit, or, or, the Jesuit order, the Scarlet Beast, is trying to scapegoat mankind. Energy vampires, satanic lovers, the epitome of chaotic evil, mentally deranged murderers. The Archon Abraxas, the lawless one, satanic evil personified, the greatest terrorist of all time. Demiurge hides the divine. So it's talking about the Demiurge here. <clears throat> the Archon Abraxas, the, the lawless one. And he hides uh, the human divinity. Yeah, and you can find it. <clears throat> you can find it if you check, uh, if you check all, all, all religions. The, the divinity of humanity is always uh, undervalued. Yeah, because the Demiurge hides the divine. Magical thinking and projection. That's also something that's being hidden by the Demiurge. Yeah, so the magical, magical thought and um, the ability to project parallel universe. Fear is a delusion becoming reality. Fear is a delusion becoming reality. Let's just continue. Source player. So it's referring to, to us here. Source player. Christ is ready. I am the rainbow, rainbow child gene. Living the script of life. Self-repairing DNA. The Eden serpent has the elixir, has elixir of life. Tree of life and death. The mystery, the golden ticket. So I'm just going to stop there. So talking about self-repairing DNA. Self-repairing DNA being the Eden serpent. And if you uh, know what DNA, DNA looks like, then you know it's uh, the double helix. And it looks like a serpent, like a serpent crawling up the tree of life. And it says here, the self-repairing DNA has the elixir of life. So since we are in the great remembrance, and I think that the self-repairing DNA is responsible responsible for for um, us being in the great in the great remembrance because it's uh, the, and the DNA is being activated to repair itself and to uh, bring back the the memories to mankind, yeah. And uh, in those uh, in those uh, 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 memories and in those in those files, if you uh, if you will. Uh, the the secret to the to the to the elixir of life is is stored. Yeah, the tree of life and death, the mystery, the golden ticket, Ordo Seclorum, the era. So new. Uh, so the world order, the era of awesome, quality of life, peace in the world, achieve anything, the state of being in heaven, the river of remembering, know thyself. Maatian current, and then it says Maatian current again. Only I think it's uh, in Italian. Corrente Maatiana. <laughs> so the river of that's talking about the river of remembering, yeah. And Maat is the Holy Spirit. So the the river of Maat, the current of Maat, the river of remember, uh, the river of remembering, the current of Maat. Yeah, the sec the sacred feminine, Mother Nature. Supernature, earth blessings, the most high God, the reflecting God, God in human form. I'm going to stop there because I think it's talking about, again, talking about all of us here. Yeah. Just like in the beginning, there's one body and one spirit. So the most high God, the reflecting God, God in human form, uh, God in human form. My only love, life is yours. Peace be with you. Have a blessed day. <laughs> I love. Uh, I'm loving those endings because it's really closing the messages with a uh, with a proper ending, and bless it, uh, wishing, uh, wishing us peace and blessings all the time. <laughs> it's super awesome. Anyways, uh, that that's the message for uh, for the new earth is here. Thanks a lot for the for the code uh, Aluna Ash. Thanks a lot for the code Aluna Ash. If you want to send in an Ascension code, remember to do so via my email address, bereancalling at gmail.com. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, 
please remember to subscribe and hit the bell so you can be kept up to date to my messages in the future. Let me know what you think of this in the comments, guys, and I'll talk to you guys later.